most cities are a hive of activity after dark. Highly connected and tech savvy, Taiwan's youth are digital natives. They are a generation who seek out new ways of expression. In a few short years, software and wireless technology will make this possible. The future's here. The future's now. The future is here. The future is now. The future is animation. Digital art is Taiwan's new soft power. From interactive gaming, e-learning and mobile apps, animation is one of the fastest growing industries. But the capital outlays are enormous and companies that don't have that kind of money fall to the wayside. Now, one company has leveled the playing field for everyone. They have democratized high technology. But high quality work takes many professional animators a long time to perfect. With limited funding, they couldn't rely on expensive labor. Instead, they're taking a different approach to drive costs down, creating clever software so the hardware does all the work. Crazy Talk is a very popular facial animation tool that allows literally anybody to animate a static photo or image and create a very vivid, lifelike animation. This kind of animation would have taken a few highly skilled professionals many days to achieve. But this software makes it possible for the layman to do it in just a few seconds. But one of the greatest challenges in computer animation has been creating human characters that look and move with the highest degree of realism. It was up to Irving and the R&D department to come up with the right mechanics. What they ended up with is puppeteering. But once took skilled artists hours of work, the facial and body expressions of an animation can be quickly adjusted with a mouse or keyboard. In the process, they also came up with another way of enhancing an animation. We talk in different ways, so it makes sense for us to have different types of animations for each scenario, and that's why we have this inside. But they didn't just stop at 2D animation. They've created a software that is redefining traditional motion capture methods. Traditional motion capture in general is a lot more expensive. Um, it's upwards of $20,000 US for a, for a good motion capture suite. Uh, whereas the Kinect sensor is actually only between $200 and $300 US. Um, you can actually get some really good animation data from this single sensor and you can later refine that. This is smashing barriers in the animation world, making ultra high quality work possible for everyone. Once a CD-ROM manufacturer in a saturated software market, they were able to find their own niche and sustainability. Taiwan的动画代工其实在世界的动画市场上已经占了非常重要的地位。我相信user自己创造出来的这种跨界的content的创作，它确实绝对是越来越蓬勃。This company is creating their own culture of animation with technology that opens up new possibilities.